is Windows Defender good enough? In this video we are gonna know if it's good enough to stick with Windows Defender if you are using Windows 10 or you have to use a third party antivirus like Avast or anything else. Let's go and do it. So we got here RV test. It's a website which uh, testing the antiviruses. It's uh, antivirus R A V. That's what does mean, and it could be trusted because uh, yeah, it could be trusted. And uh, I have seen this uh, website in some of the tech uh, articles, and this is promising. So we got here the Windows 10. Uh, I mean the best antivirus software for Windows Home user. So yeah, they they test all the antiviruses here. I can leave the link in the description so you will go and check out because they do that uh, monthly and maybe it will help you. Actually, not monthly, but uh, yeah, they they do that so often. Anyways, so uh, as you can see here, if we go and scroll down and go to the Windows Defender, here we go. They have six, six, six. It does mean they are uh, the Windows Defender is good at protection, performance, and usability. So yeah, uh, the score is six, 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 which is great. And uh, we also got here Kaspersky, which. Uh, which is also a very known uh, antivirus it has also a 666 but uh, it's paid and yeah I think it doesn't worth it if you already got something uh, something has the same score and which is free for those who are uh, using Windows 10 and uh, also Norton Norton is also great in a great position and great s score Norton so it has six 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 and so on we also got uh, save 17 f secure it's what uh, this antivirus called they also got six 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 which is also amazing and whatever if you got uh, something else it's not really bad like free antivirus uh, avast avast is a free antivirus it almost has the same uh, <laughs> the same score except the protection they say the protection of uh, Microsoft Windows Defender is better and uh, yeah that's what uh, they think and I think that too I was using my Windows 10 for for about three years now and uh, yeah I was just using the Windows Defender and uh, there was many <laughs> malwares because I love to try new programs and and yeah I try many websites I previously I didn't know the websites that are safe for me so I just go ahead and download and then I got a malware oh and then uh, I'm very lucky that I got uh, Windows Defender it helped me now uh, if I got a malware and yeah it actually removed it and it's great I, I never had a virus staying in my computer and that's amazing because of the Microsoft Defender so that's it you don't really need anything else but let's go deep into it before we move forward and give you a proof of what I'm saying and uh, you should trust Windows Defender, I want to introduce you to Brad Anderson, the Vice President of Microsoft and also the manager of the Microsoft uh, 365 which is uh, the office, the most, uh, the most important <laughs> the most important software to uh, Microsoft actually. So yeah not really the most important but it must be something important and they care about it a lot and yeah Brad Anderson I told you who he is and now in his tweet he just said that check this out Windows Defender classified as best antivirus 
by independent l lab and uh, uh, so yeah they are the AV test the website we was in and he blogged it last year so yeah he already saw that and now he confirmed that he really trusted and uh, that seemed obvious honestly and now he said Defender is now the most commonly used on the virus in the enterprise and SMB customers whatever this seems too complicated but I heard in an article that uh, the users of um, Microsoft Defend Windows Defender is more than half million and which is incredible number and this means most of people is using it and this is a good choice and I I personally use it I personally use it for three years or four years and I never used a third party antivirus so don't listen to your friends who, who say who come to you and say go install an antivirus man you don't have <laughs> antivirus and that's not true because you already got a, a built in antivirus if you got Windows 10 if you have Mac OS it's something else and I'm not sure because I don't have Mac OS yet anyways so that's what I'm trying to say and I hope you just understand it and yeah this was this the third uh, episode of the software enthusiastics if you want to see more about the this episode make sure you just go to the link in the description and you will see more about it and I hope you just uh, like this video if you like it and dislike it if uh, anything wrong and uh, yeah maybe you don't like this idea of using and sticking to Windows Defender so yeah make sure to do that or not and tell me in this comment section also what you think feel free and subscribe maybe so you will see the next video peace